All right then. Have a good day there, Renel. Thank you, Steven. Nice to see you, Snowflake. Nice to see you too. Oh, hey, Relic. Hey, Steven. So you're like the principal here, right? Seems like a big job for a 17-year-old. It can be a little stressful at times, but as long as I'm helping all these gems, it makes it all worth it. Yeah, that's cool, I guess. Well, that's enough about me. How are you feeling about being the first human to attend little homeschool? It's a bit pressuring. I mean, being the first of anything is pressuring. But being the first human to join this school? Well, it's something I never imagined being a part of, that's for sure. Right, that's understandable. But trust me, you're gonna learn a lot about gems and the planet Earth. If you say so, I still feel this is a little weird. I mean, isn't school designed specifically for you guys? Uh, kinda? I mean, you wanted to learn more about gems in Beach City, so now you can! If you say so. Hey, uh, do you think you want to grab some pizza after school? Yeah, I think I like that. Dancing is cool. Class over. Garnet, there's a lot more to dancing than just that. Here, let me show you. Of course a pearl knows about dancing. Huh? Oh, what do you mean? A human? Oh, you're that kid Steven was talking about. So this is what flesh looks like. Hey! hey. Relic, no talking during demonstrations. Now then, dancing can take a lot of forms. There are many styles to choose from. It's best to figure out which one expresses you the most. So, in other words, just do you. Yes, do you. Now sometimes, dancing can cause fusion. Don't be alarmed. It's alright to fuse. That means your bond with someone is strong. Uh, fuse? Like this. Hello everybody! It's very nice to see you all today. The name's Sardonyx and I'm here to teach you how to dance. I... I... Uh... I... 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 Uh... Let's start off with the basics. Huh, weird. I thought this was gonna be super boring, but this is actually pretty fun. Shoot, okay, one foot here, one foot there. No wait, no, both feet here and then, ah! Is something troubling you, Relic? Dancing is something I've never really been good at, or even tried doing, so this is really weird. Plus, you gems seem to have a experience while dancing. Hmm, I see. It's because you're organic, right? Well, don't worry. Pearl and Garnet have, have seen plenty of humans dance before. Pearl's even danced with one before. Now then, it's really simple. Just go like this, uh, whoa, then that, this, this is and a that, kind of and weird. twirl <laughs> like this. It's like that at first. Now again, this, then twirl, then jump. All right, this is baseball. We're playing it. Good luck. Wait, that's all she's saying? Isn't she supposed to be a t- LET'S DO THIS! YOU READY TO DO THIS, HUMAN? My name is Relic, just so you know. Whatever! Ha! Huh! What the- Did- Did I win? Uh-oh. That's not good. Can we get a Steven on the field? We need a Steven! Lapis? What's wrong? What happened? He got hit by the ball. <sighs> Alright. 
clear! <laughs> Steven, what happened? Ocean Jasper threw the ball too hard and it hit you really hard. Oh, get over you little- Whoa, whoa Relic, let's calm down now. I'm sure, uh, Ocean Jasper didn't mean it. Right, Ocean Jasper? Yo, man, sorry. I didn't know humans were that fragile. Oh, you little- Whoa, hey, hey, uh, maybe we should try something a little less physical? Yeah, what up, dudes? Today you're gonna learn how to do nothing. Step one. There is no step one. Just do what you want. Yo, Amethyst, I heard you like food. Catch. Yo, my dude Rally cooking me up with that good food. Oh, wow, that was quick. All right, class over. Yo, P, you wanna go grab some pizza? Hey, Relic, you ready to go grab that pizza? Uh, yeah, sure. So, what'd you think? It was interesting to say at least. Interesting good or interesting bad? Steven, my day consisted of me getting puppeted by, I think, a fusion if I've seen enough anime. Getting hit in the face with a baseball and getting left alone in the class, what do you think? Interesting bad then. I don't know. I mean, it was one day. I can't just call it bad yet, but it just felt weird. Like, I didn't belong. I'm not a gem, Steven. I don't have superhuman strength or can shape my limbs or get hit and not feel pain. Which, by the way, raises a lot of questions in my mind. I get it. Is there anything me and the others could do to help you feel more comfortable here? Man, I'm not sure. I'm not sure there is anything you can do, Steven. I just feel so out of place here. I know it's my first day, and I'm not trying to overreact, but I almost died today in baseball. I can make an announcement saying, Go easy on him, he's human! Maybe that could make things a little better? Plus, we can modify your schedule to something that makes you more comfortable? That might help. It's a start. I wish Garnet would have let me do your schedule, but she kept saying that you'd be fine. If it would have been up to me, I wouldn't have put you in all those tough classes. I mean, honestly, the part of the thing that is upsetting me is that I can't do the stuff they can do. I know how you feel. When I was a kid, the gems used to not allow me to go on missions because I couldn't control my powers. I felt so weak and useless, but I changed and grew because of that change. You may not be a gem relic, but that doesn't mean you can't change. I have a friend named Connie, and she's been getting trained by Pearl for years now, and she's strong. Your point being... You can be too. Look, I'm not saying you need to train for battle or war like she did, but I'm sure if we work together, you could become just like any other gem at the school. Without the gem, of course. If you say so, Steven. Ah! Huh? What was that? Whoa, Jenny, what happened? I was just cooking this pizza, see? And all of a sudden, the oven just catches on fire! <sighs> I thought with Kiki out for the day I'd be able to cook the pizzas. Guess I'm just good at slicing them. Did you say cooking the pizza? Uh, yes, I did. Who are you? Oh, right. Uh, Jenny, this is Relic. Oh, nice to meet you, Relic. You know, back where I used to live, I was really good at cooking. Maybe I could help out. Well, I mean, if you say so. Great, just uh, show me the recipe and I can get started. Oh, right, of course. Follow me. He likes to cook. I got it! Welcome to cooking class. Uh, I, I don't know if this is a good idea, Steven. It will be great, Relic. Garnet used to cook for me sometimes. You should just be happy it wasn't Amethyst. Uh, uh. Alright. On Earth, the humans to survive have to consume something called food. This is food. Uh. 
Now, gems don't need food, but we can need it anyway. Today we're going to make one of Earth's best foods, the pizza. We actually have a human in our classroom who has made one of these before, so I'm going to let him show you how it's made. Come on up, Relic. Oh, I didn't expect this, but um, okay. Well, make the pizza. Alright then, well of course you gotta start off with a piece of dough, and then you throw the air like this. Uh, yeah? Why are you doing that? Well, it's to soften up the dough so you can roll it into the shape of pizza. Oh! Cool! <laughs> Steven, are you sure this is a good idea? I mean, you don't have to treat me special. Yeah, I know that, but... Even if I don't do that, this is a gigantic step for Little Homeworld. I want all the Homeworld gems out there to know how far Little Homeworld has come. If you say so. Okay, Steven and Relic, we are live in three, two, one, action! Hey, all you gems out there! Steven here. Little Homeworld is making more and more advancements each day. More and more reformed gems arrive each and every day. But today, Little Homeschool announces something big. To get a closer relationship with the planet, we've decided that Little Homeschool is now accepting organic life. That's right, we're getting closer and closer to that perfect harmony between gem and planet. And here today I have the first organic being, a human named Relic. Say hi to Homeworld, Relic. Hi, Homeworld. <laughs> now, Relic, are you happy at Little Homeschool? Uh, uh yeah, it's pretty nice. Great, good to hear. Is it cool being in a school with gems for you? It was a little weird at first, but I'm getting used to it. And what about other humans? Do you think they'd like it here? I think they would, actually. Again, it took some modification on my schedule. Oh, right. To all the students of Little Homeschool, go a little easy on him with the sports and stuff. He's human, so his body is not as strong as other gems. That's all for now. We can't wait to see you at Little Homeschool! We can't wait to see you at Little Homeschool! Ugh! That Steven Universe in his Era 3 life! Now he's letting humans into that little school of his! This is infuriating! I know exactly what you mean. The diamonds are just letting that Steven do whatever he wants with Homeworld, just because he has pink diamonds gemstone. And yet he's nothing like pink diamond. From stories I heard, she was ruthless in the way she led. She led her conquests against the rebellion hard and strong. She would shatter any gem out of line with no mercy. Ruby, you foolish idiot. Don't you know all those things are just legends? Pink Diamond ended up shattering herself, remember? She was the traitorous Rose Quartz. Oh, right. It'd still be nice to have a diamond that was like the legends, though. I'm sure they could set Homeworld right. Ruby, you're brilliant! I am? Yes, you are. Think about it. We get the smartest gym to create the perfect pink diamond replica. Then when the diamonds aren't thinking, we brainwash the clone, and they become the perfect diamond. They'd send Homeworld to an era never seen before. Homeworld's empire would control the entire galaxy. And then me and you are on the top, as the one who's on top is our slave. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good idea, Aquamarine. All right, Steven Universe. Prepare to lose your empire to the strongest gyms in the universe. Henceforth, you will heed the name Aquamarine. Hey, what about me? Oh, yes, you too. <laughs> 